introduce uh, to you Mr. Apollo. Thanks everyone, thanks for coming to this motorbicycle on the streets. Okay, we, we have heard a hundred of times that we are living in a very competitive, very demanding world, very trendy world, and it's true. But it's not the first time that happens. Our ancestors managed to survive thousands of years ago to situations much more difficult than current today. And they succeed because we are the most extraordinary, the most successful creatures on earth. as a key of success in a changing area. Uh, this is the, the Strait of Gibraltar. I crossed it swimming in 2007. You know, it's a super it's challenge. Very, it's very demanding challenge, not only physically, because I remember that I swim more than five kilometers per day in training, but also psychologically. And how to manage this adversity with self-control. Self-control is the best way to overcome to situations like this. We were here and the current enter, we make our trouble or problem to convert into our ally and the current help us to reach to the coast of Africa. In the case of the swimmer from Finland, the professional swimmer, the current was so high that when he was here, pushed him out of his target field, and he never touched the coast. And finally, we reached to the coast of Africa. So we use determination, we use uh, constancy, finally, we get our target in life. Okay, we change the continent, we go to America. I won the New York Marathon in 2008. Also, because we need recognition in our life. When we run, something magic happens, is that we, we are able to keep the best of ourselves, the best of our heart. In 2009, I think, I do the border to border cross country ski from the border of uh, Russia to the border of Sweden. It's about 500 kilometers cross country ski. It's very hard and challenging. You have demonstrated that uh, uh, aptitude is very important in our life. If we are big, if we are whatever, but attitude is even more important. What I want to tell you is the aptitude will help you uh, to make things easier to, to achieve your life, your, your targets, you know. But this attitude what will uh, guarantee us success forever, forever, okay? Attitude is like a way of life. Deserts of Jordan. In 2010, I ran the Jordan Marathon to the lowest point on earth. Don't forget this planning. I didn't plan this this race. Okay? So this is the profile of the race. I saw it and I say okay, it's going to be very easy because it's in the way down, it's in the center. You never on the value a challenge. No matter how easy a challenge might appear because external factors and external inputs might change the final results. To Greenland, this is the Polar Circle Marathon. I won it in 2010. And uh, in this case, it was just the opposite. I learned that this AB number is alright, and I know here all the profile of the race. So I knew in every moment where I was exactly. And I remember that two kilometers previous to the finish line, there was a technical section. So I know exactly where this point was. I drink some isotonic, I drop some chocolate, and I say, okay, this is the moment to go. 
I jump, I open a gap, I lead them. Is your life is like a long distance marathon. No matter the position that you start, you can start at the 20, the 50, whatever. But if you use the appropriate strategy, life will give you opportunities enough to be in the position that you deserve. Okay? And you will be climbing positions in your life if you do the things correctly. in Tibet to Kathmandu in Nepal. It's uh, about 1,300 kilometers and more than, this is the Everest base camp. It's values like trust, friendship, loyalty, what make relationships incredible on time and successful forever. This is very important also because we are living actually in a crisis of values. This marathon because for me it was a very inspirational experience. I want to have an inspirational experience. For me, Kenya, Tanzania is the place where everything began, so where the first humans start hunting, start moving, start exploring. It was a magic experience. Uh, inspiration has been very important in my life. Get a lot of same reasons for me feels motivation and motivation feels determination and about determination is my last challenge the Inca Trail to Machu Picchu Marathon I ran it in 2012 I was also very happy because I got the victory in this race I feel that if you want to achieve your dreams in your life Wake up, start walking forward, and your dreams will come to you. Thank you very much.